Well, listen, a network is network is absolute bullshit unless you have the business, and you are so far away from that. I mean, come on, that's just ridiculous to even, to even come to me with that. Okay, we're going to the World Blockchain Forum. It's happening here in London in the old Billingsgate fish market. And why we are going there today is that we have a podcast interview, both myself, Charles Story, um, are going to be talking in length about SVK crypto and also connecting with the crypto and blockchain community here in London and from abroad. Okay, standing and waiting for a taxi. That's how we really roll around shortage. Hey buddy, I've only got about um, five to seven minutes. How are you raising money on the token? Is it an ERC20 token? Okay, and where are you with regards to any type of regulation for this type of product? It's amazing. Okay, cool. Just so I can be really clear, where are you currently at with regards to that type of submission with the FCA? What do you need? What do you need twenty-five million dollars for? I got it. So, so what type of equity is on offer here? A one percent per million. So, what you're valuing your business at this point in time without any sort of regulatory approval at a hundred million dollars? Are, are you guys fucking nuts? No, I'm serious. I'm serious. Come on, I'm absolutely serious. Like, listen, network is absolute bullshit. Un, un, unless you have the business and you are so far away from that. I mean, come on, that's just ridiculous to even, to even come to me with that. Well, I'd have to go look at your valuations, but just come on, look, look I mean, look, look at what you guys are trying to do. You, don't, you have very little done right now. You're building it all out. You've got an idea, right? And it would be wrong for me to even justify any type of valuation until I, until I take a proper serious look. But when someone says to me, an applied valuation of $100 million in this market with where you guys are at? I mean, seriously. No, I'm, t I'm, t I'm talking, I'm from the reality side. Like, look at where the market's at, guys. Like, lo look, look at what's happening. And you guys are coming to the market looking to, you know, looking to have an applied valuation at $100 million and, and, and raise money off the back of that. That's, that's scare that scares me. Okay, I got to jump. Uh, send, send me over what you got, and um, I'll give you my word that we'll look at it. But hey, just before you go, have you come to any of our, our our meetups? Have you have you come into our community? Okay, I'll be looking forward to seeing that. Thanks, thanks very much. Send it all over, and I'll circle back to you. Thank you very much. All the best. Have a great day. Bye bye. I mean, what did he have? He had a pipe dream, huh? and he had my phone number. I should have given him yours. <laughs> 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 I think it's our job to, you know, spend the time and, you know, move through the projects and help and support. Um, listen, we're in London, and um, I believe it's it's, you know, really uh, our responsibility to help and support and grow the community like what we've been doing since day one. And this building is the new Bloomberg building, by the way. And they've done, an, they've done a great job on it. It's the most advanced it. building in the world, right? And the most advanced building technologically. Where's Kingsland University? Okay. Are global. Our first oh, okay. one was in Sofia, Bulgaria. We've yeah. done cohorts in Ilo, Ilo in the Philippines and gotcha. in um, Singapore. Singapore. Okay. Also so, how do you keep in contact with your ever-growing community? Is it a Telegram? Is it a website? Is how, how do you do it? We have a newsletter that we send out all okay. the time, and we have a series of different um, email lists, basically, okay. so depending on which product you're interested. Can in. Can you stick me on the newsletter? Yeah, absolutely. I'd really like to see it. Hey, thanks very much. I really you appreciate. Uh, do you know what? I'm, I'm probably okay for the t-shirts, although, although they're, they're very nice, but um, I don't want to carry anything with me. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going. But they're, they're, they, look, they look very beautiful. They're, they're, uh, 
But hey, thanks very much. I appreciate your time. But please put me on that newsletter, okay? Excellent. Thanks a lot. That's Ross. See you okay. Hey, Hello. I'm Shane Kehoe. Nice hey, to meet you. Hey, yeah, Raj, I met before. Hey, James. Hi, James. Excellent. Shane Kehoe, nice to meet you, mate. How are you? Are you well? My name is Shane Kehoe. I'm one of the co-founders of SVK Crypto, which is a London-based firm. We are very community-driven. Me, personally, investment professional by nature, but now I've left the dark side of finance behind and I'm fully focused on crypto and blockchain. What crypto assets slash tokens slash coins are you currently holding and why? We're big believers in EOS. We really do love it. And we, all, we also know we're only getting started. Of course, our gateway drug was Bitcoin. It was the first cryptocurrency that we bought and then of course Ethereum. But uh, we, we believe that the whole space will continue to grow. What advice would you give to newcomers who go into crypto at the end of 2017? Hold on for dear life, because you're going to need it. Uh, educate, educate, educate. You cannot, you cannot learn more in this space. Just keep on reading, networking, connecting, and also just adding to the overall community. Hey, my name's Charles Story. I'm head of strategic partnerships at SVK Crypto, which is a London-based community firm. How did you first hear about crypto and blockchain technology? Well, back in 2014 for a mutual friend who beat me to it, but um, we've been working ever hard since. What crypto assets slash tokens slash coins are you currently holding and why? All EOS. We believe that's the future. What advice would you give to newcomers who go into crypto at the end of 2017 during the massive boom? It doesn't matter when you come in. Always do your own research and know why you hold what you do. And lastly, which projects are you currently looking forward to and why? I'm super excited about the EOS IO protocol and all the dApps that are coming out. EOS Bet is one that has me the most excited at present, doing over 200,000 transactions per day in the first two weeks of business. Brilliant. Hey, nice to meet you. Abby, How nice are you? Yeah, Abby. So how's things going? What, what are you working on? Yeah. What's happening? Good. Um, I mean, with Crypto Compare, uh, we kind of run the news site. Yeah. Uh, okay. But with Crypto Compare, um, we're adding more exchanges, uh, adding more coins. Right. Uh, we've got our ICO data. Right. Uh, and recently, we just partnered with Thomson Reuters. Right. Uh, okay. Congratulations, so by the way. Well yeah, thank you. That was a big that's surprise. Uh, so that's good. Um, uh, do they have many other feeds for data? Uh, they do. They. I mean. We're the biggest cryptocurrency data provider they have. Right. Uh, and we're also partnering with someone called Envis, um, right. who is helping. We've got like a sort of crypto index with them. Right. And they're pushing our data out as well. Cool. Um, okay. so and, yeah. and on the new side of stuff, um, um, how do you guys go and generate content? Is it just what you hear through your network and through your... Yeah, a lot on Twitter. Like <laughs> we, uh, we're following like all the right accounts. Uh, yeah. And then as soon as something breaks... Right, we're you guys. Our, yeah. Telegram's big as well. Telegram's yeah. pretty oh. big. Okay. Um, yeah, we basically like to sort of keep really close to the community, and okay. then um, as soon as anything kind of makes waves, we, we yeah. cover it as we fast as we can. We have our own site called Crypto Globe. You have a Crypto, Crypto Globe, this is our site. Okay, great. Oh, okay, so we're managing our team there to achieve. Okay, cool. Um, there you go. Hello, Shane. We, we, you we met last week. Yeah, yeah, yeah nice yeah. to meet you. Um, you were with a younger guy, and I was really interested that's to right. see what he was doing. Hi, how are you? I'm Shane Keogh. Yeah, nice, nice to meet, meet you. you. How are you? Yeah, so, we've not actually met before. you, well, you just, you've got a memory, I've got a great well memory. Done, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he was, uh, he was looking at launching his own his token. Own token. <laughs> Oh, that's what I remember. So uh, I'm really always interested in the younger guys and where their heads yeah, at and where yeah, their space yeah, is yeah. at because yeah. it's kind of our job, really, you know, to kind of figure out what they're doing. Yeah. You know? I think you've got that on your back there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to catch up with you because um, uh, I mentioned to you about the, the, the energy program we're yeah. working on. Yeah. And we want to use uh, EOS to do that yeah. as our protocol. Yeah. But I'm struggling to find any developers okay. that can help us write um, okay, the white me... paper and take us to the tokenomics and all that. Okay. So I appreciate that. Yeah, get to it. Uh, you, you, you got to go and mingle. I'll catch you okay, later. See you later, guys. <laughs> so How are you? How are you? Good to see you, my man. <laughs> How are you? Do you know, it's about time you got out of that house. Know, and behind, behind, yeah, it's about time you got out from behind the earning know, board. You know, know. It's cool. Hey, right? I'm Shane uh, Kehoe. Sorry, Max. Nice Max. to meet you, Max. Yeah, this is Max, I'm Charles. Charles. Uh, and this gentleman's name, sorry. Yeah, this is our this is our friend from Korea. Hi, nice to meet you. Hi. Okay, Great so. To see you, man. How's things? So Max, really good friend. Okay. He's putting on a crypto show at the end of October. Okay. Halloween time. Yeah, Halloween, Halloween time. Twenty eighth, twenty ninth, thirtieth of October. Yeah. Oh, okay. And he's got Roger Ver confirmed. Okay. Today okay. To so he got him to. Yeah. Okay. I'm very familiar with uh, oh, Vene Gupta. Yeah, okay. Yeah. He's okay. my friend. Oh, he's yeah. a great guy. Yeah. yeah. 
yeah. I just was dining him uh, lunch yeah. ago. Uh, Great. For, for yeah, hotel. listen, I'm very so aware you, of Civic you, you, and everything he's done on that side. Talk and okay. He's a fucking great guy. Okay. SBK thank, crypto, thank, thank how did you, you, you contribute to, to, to that, really, just by oh, adding value? Well, Tell listen. Who you are. Um, oh, I, I know. It's like Silla Black. What's your name and where'd you come from? Well, listen, um, I think with us, uh, with SVK Crypto, um, it's not just about contributing to that event. It's been okay. actually what we've been contributing for the last two years since the inception. Okay, okay. It's, it's broader than that. Uh, absolutely, it's, it's, it's more than that. And, yeah. and let me give you the elevator 30 second pitch. We've been involved since 2016. We're investors by nature at the core of our business. We have probably the largest venture capital fund here in London. In the UK, okay. it's, it's not about just check writing, okay? okay. And, and previous, before I set up SVK Crypto, I worked for Bluecrest Capital Management. I was a partner there. We ran $35 billion, right? Okay. And when you see the likes of Alan Howard and Lewis Bacon from Morecap and Brevin coming in, they're going to do the same thing. Let me write, let me get a check and write it. It's not about that. It's about community, right? And what we've done over the last two years and how we've built our business is by building out a community. And how have we done that? Yeah, we've added value. We hold the largest monthly meetups in London. We do them every month for free. We've Dickie's the man, man. Dickie's the man, right? He's bridging crypto, crypto to finance and everything in between. So we're making it happen together, right? Okay. A lot of work has been done already. Okay. We've been, it's been long preparation, really. Right. We've been beavering away for the last five months. Okay. Was actually over a glass of beer with Vinay. That, that yes. Just had a great way. Okay. This. I mean, it's a shame, you know, in this country, it's, uh, it hasn't been an event of that caliber. I mean, there have we'll, been we'll lots see of events. Yes, yeah, sorry. Seven see. confirmed ministers coming over. Can you imagine? Okay, wow. He's doing a black tie time. dinner party in the evening as well. Okay, oh, very nice. nice dinner. Yeah. Okay, very Crypto nice. Crypto personality of the year. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh. Stop you, stop you. <laughs> stop you, yeah, okay. Seriously, we've got seven ministers confirmed. Okay. Uh, innovation ministers and economics ministers from minor to like. Well, it. listen, we'd love to be able to come yeah. down. Uh, the opportunity to speak on a panel would be wonderful. Mm. Uh, we record all our video content. Uh, we would a blog. No, 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 I'm not right. I knew the camera was there. Um, but we would be able to spread the word through our London community. Beforehand. Oh, absolutely, yeah, absolutely beforehand, yeah. They've got and, a great community. And we, we, we speak to everybody and we're liked by everybody because we're not selling anything, okay. we're not yeah. asking for anything, yeah. we're literally all about giving back. Of course, that helps you did, with you deal did a flow. Great keynote. I don't know what the event was, it might have even been your own event where you said you will not invest in anything that's been really well marketed. Yeah, marketing <laughs> is dead. Yeah, market is dead, market we is want dead. community. Yeah. We want community. And but it's then the, the question is, how do you get fucking community if you don't do any marketing? Well, I'll it's tell you how you do it. You, it's, yeah. it's, it's giving back yeah. and giving and adding value yeah. to people and not yeah. asking for any return. And yeah. so many other ICOs have it like the other this. way around, right? Like it's coming down to networking yeah. and it is. listen, Completely. it's only the start. Mate, Thank you awesome very much for pitching me. Yeah, I really no appreciate worries, it. Max, no listen, it's a pleasure to meet Absolutely. you and I wish Looking you all the best to, with that. To, okay. To seeing you on stage. Okay, I'll send you over all my details tomorrow. I'll give you all my PA's details and we'll go from there. Okay, Here thank you very go. much, gentlemen. Great Thanks a lot. Nice to see you. How nice are you? Nice to see you. Good. How are you? Are you well? Welcome to yeah, London. Yeah, thank you, man. Uh, Shane That's Kehoe. Nice Nicholas, nice to, nice to meet you, Nicholas. Hi. And you are? I'm Jerome. Jerome, nice to meet you. Shane Kehoe. And you are? Alex. Alex, nice to meet you. All welcome to London. So where has everyone come from? Well, you're yeah, from we, Holland. Yeah. Right, I know, yeah. where, I know where you've come from. But you guys? Belgium, okay. Cool, cool. And yourself? Switzerland. Switzerland, okay. So uh, how's it been thus far? You've been hanging out with this guy? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, Tell about SVK to these guys, because okay. they're going to be setting up a fund. Okay, great. So who's setting up a fund? The Belgian dudes. The Belgian dudes. Yeah, we, we do some more. How's, how's it going so far? Um, challenging. Good, yeah. Good, good in terms of challenging. Yeah, fucking hard. Yeah. Okay. So there's plenty of good projects to go for, and uh, we've, we've identified a few, few very good ones and started investing. So we feel quite positive <coughs> about the market. Uh, the, the problem we having is we're facing is, is, is how to structure it, uh, knowing that in Belgium it's, it's quite complicated. Uh, Luxembourg, I've seen some funds coming out of Luxembourg, um, as numerous different um, structures, CCAV structures. Um, I don't know much about the structure in Luxembourg, I just have had people come to me saying that they were doing it. Um, for, um, for SVK Crypto, You know, it's really nice to actually be here in London. We travel all over the world and yeah. we meet the most amazing people, yeah. see the most greatest projects, but it's lovely to be back in our hometown, our home turf. I believe BF, World Blockchain Forum, and you know what, it's been actually really refreshing. Um, we didn't get the chance to spend much time here today, but what we did do is we came down and we connected with lots of different people that we know.
and lots of people that we really, really like. And it's great to welcome into our community. And it's great to see them put yeah. on a great event like this today. Absolutely. And I think what's more unexpected is the people you didn't think you'd see here. Yeah. You know, the people we respect all around the world. And, they all, and you meet them all behind corners of the event, wherever they may be, from Amsterdam, from Korea. And it's great to have everyone in one place, man. And um, the vibe, there's only positive vibes here. Well, do you know what's really interesting, Charles, is each and every day I get calls from people in Korea, Japan, Hong Kong, North America, South America, Asia, Middle East, Eastern Europe, all saying the same thing. London is the blockchain capital <laughs> of the world. And I hate to admit it, but I agree with them. <laughs> well, that's hard since you're from Dublin, Ireland, it's man. It's very hard, it's very hard. <laughs> but I really think that SVK Crypto, since when we became exposed to the blockchain and cryptocurrency yeah. space back in 2016, have always been out there pushing and building and creating, and we still do to this day. So it's wonderful for people to start noticing all the combined efforts of what's been going on in London to call it the blockchain capital of the world. But for now, <laughs> I'm gonna go with that. Oh yeah, man, and I also wanna just say how honored we are. Because when we first started, we had to get people onto our podcast to interview them. We had to add value. Oh, hold on. Oh, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> Radix! <laughs> Mr. Blockchain of Mr. Radix. We're not blockchain, we're a DLT. Hey, oh, hey Adrian, man. What's going on? We were just talking about London being the blockchain capital of the world. And nothing. The, no, no, no. The fintech world capital. The fintech, the fintech, world, fintech capital. world capital. Okay, well, whatever it is, me. whatever yeah, it is, we're all in this together. together yeah. And it's lovely to be with uh, my man Robert and my man Aaron. Adrian. So thank you so much for popping by. You're have, have a lovely day, we gentlemen. Speak to uh, later. I look forward to seeing you all. Okay, bye, bye, guys. Okay. Bye, 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 bye. Just, <laughs> just a part of the London, uh, the London outfit we got. <laughs> yeah, but we really like those guys. We really like Robert from Radix, and we really, really love. Adrian. Adrian White, White, man. Adrian White, who's doing a, a phenomenal event upcoming in London, and he's also very much involved in stuff that's going on in Malta, so that's pretty cool. But also, we feel honored, right? Because we're invited today here as a media aspect, but also to do interviews with people, and any opportunity that we have to give back to, or help anyone out here, whether it is doing an interview, or whether it's helping someone with websites or a connection to somewhere, we always take the opportunity to do that, because that's how, and what people did for us. Absolutely. And I know we're both passionate about doing what we can to help anyone else. Absolutely. Um, anything that we can do for the London cryptocurrency and blockchain community, we do. We're very active. Yeah. We are on it, you know, pretty much 24 7, 365. <laughs> and, and we love it. Like, we really, really love it. And it's, it's, it's great to see. And I'm really interested, Charles, to see what the next wave is going to be like, right? We all understand where the markets have come from and where they've got to and where they currently are. But for me, it's all about the next year, right? It's all about the next five. It's all about the next 10. And I think it's just the most exciting time to be in cryptocurrency and blockchain technology. I really am looking forward to it.